plastic is entering our food chain. It means that we eat the plastic that we consume. Doesn't it trigger you? Well, stay with me in this video in order to know more about this. This is Sustainable Log. The journey between the moment when we consume our plus and the moment when we eventually eat it is split into two parts. First, plastic gets to the ocean, then plastic gets to the fishes, and fishes represent our seafood. But let's go from the beginning. There are three ways plastic can get to the ocean. The first one is basic littering. Plastic that is in the street, if it's not taken from the urban services, it's probably going in the drains. The drains are connected to the rivers. The rivers are finally ending up in the sea. The second way is whenever you throw away your plastic, not in the plastic recycling bin, but in the general waste bin. All of this amount goes into the landfills. The landfills are those huge amounts of waste that are left there. And the problem is that plastic is lightweight, so it's easily blown away by the wind and uh, transferred to the drains that are the same as before, connected to the rivers and finally to the ocean. The third way is the least immediate to think about. Take this piece of clothing. This is probably made out of acrylic fiber. When I wash this in the washing machine, this fiber has micro particles that flow and are not filtered. So those waste splashes of water go into the rivers and finally into the sea as the plastic we mentioned before. Once all this amount of plastic is in the sea, well, we can have big things like this or we can have smaller things like, I don't know, the packaging of this. What happens is that after the tides, the waves, the wind make their job, all this plastic becomes very, very tiny. I mean, under five millimeters, we can call up piece of plastic a microplastic that it's hardly to see with our eyes. These plastics are perfect for fishes to be confused for food. So we give something to eat to what it's going to become our seafood. But the point here is that the least amount of plastic we buy, we consume, the better it is because you never know where plastic goes. Next time you go to the supermarket and it comes to you to make a choice, think about it more carefully. If you like this kind of content, just subscribe to my channel, I would be really thankful. And if you want some similar content on a daily basis, follow my Instagram page which is written down below. Bye guys, take care and be sustainable.